Something that I really liked about the CDT was the idea of being able to get a breadth of studying in first year. You're not tied to a research project when you start. First year really brings everyone up to scratch. Being part of a cohort is great because you end up learning from your cohort members and everyone has a different set of skills. And because we all have these different skills, we can actually work together and create something that we definitely couldn't have done individually. We are not only in Bristol, we are sometimes travelling to Sussex, sometimes to Cambridge. During the first year of the CDT, every year goes on an industrial visit. In our year, we got to go to California and we got to visit some really big names in sort of quantum technologies. Actually meeting companies which are receiving millions of dollars of investment in order to try and develop technology using this physics is really exciting. The clean rooms of Bristol are world class and it was amazing to be able to learn how to use this equipment. I've enjoyed being in the lab a lot more than I expected to, actually having come from a lot more theoretical background. Everyone is encouraged to work both on the applied and the theoretical sides of the problem. You end up doing a three-month project in both probably working hands-on or something, like maybe designing a chip, but then also doing something more theoretical, which might involve computer simulation, or even doing some pen and paper maths. Every week we have guest speakers come in. Sometimes it's people within the group. Quite often it's people from other institutions. The first year of the CDT has made me realise how interesting and exciting the opportunities in quantum technologies are. But if you're interested in this interdisciplinary approach to a really interesting subject where you're bringing in the physics, the maths, the computer science, the engineering. And I would recommend this programme to anyone interested in quantum technology.